Well, hello! Welcome back to another exciting episode of Mind Test Gameplay of Swords. And we're gonna make some waffles. Today we're gonna look at a new build. Yes, we are. Look at it. We got waffles. All right. Let me finish my waffles. And <laughs> let's go. And if you like what you see here, please consider liking and subscribing. It's greatly appreciated. Let me get rid of my, um, there we go. Look at that. Dishes are done automatically. So we're going to take a look at the new build and nighttime. It's always nighttime. I can never like, I don't know. Make it so it's daytime, like when I start the video without having to go in and hit daytime. So there it is. It's off of this road, and I, I have to dead end this road because there's nothing on the other side. Just uh, a lot of hills and caverns, not, in, not anything to make it go into. So here is the new build, and it was supposed to be this kind of hub where see if i can show it this kind of hub system and yeah it wasn't working for me even though the interior looked really really cool it was not working so hi mr bunny so <laughs> we have this to start and it's right off of the apple orchards over there uh let's go inside very cool. Mixing it up with some cool materials. This is going to be plants. Yes. There is sort of. Got this real cool atrium, atrium going on here with the uh, sloped clean glass. Yeah, nice swimming pool. Waterfall. Waterfall has a real cool quirk in it. If you go into the water, you can swim up. Look at that. Cool. So, real quickly, uh, we had some comments on the replacer. And most of my videos, what I do is, when I review a mod, because I play in creative uh, and not survival, it kind of doesn't uh, explain the mod fully. So I'm going to do a better job on that. And such as Nathan pointed out on the replacer mod, that when you use the replacer mod in um, in survival mode, you have to, uh, have that item in your inventory for it to work. So, yeah. And obviously if you right click, just right click on it, it'll put a node, but then you left click, it'll change a node. So it works pretty cool. And I'm going to change that back because I, I, I really do want that. What the? Mm, another. There we go. I really do like that replacer now that I've read the directions. And another thing to get the best information from your mod, read the, read the readme files and everything else. So this is the tentative layout. And I'm not sold on the glass yet. Uh, I'm probably going to end up using the white uh, glass for more privacy and better looks. But, and I'm trying to get away from the all glass look. But in this case, I still want to use it. So that whole area, there's going to be two bedrooms, nice little uh, reading area, uh, a sunken living room, which is going to be really, really cool. And go from there. And then it has this great, you know, every, like I said, I judge, I pick my builds in areas that have the, the best builds. Best builds. The best views. Yeah, and look at that one. It edges up to the desert biome. So that's going to be, that's going to be really cool. And over here, you can see there's a, there's a, there's water down there and there's some palm trees. So it's really cool. 
and I have some more landscaping to do and things to pick out here. So basically, I got this real cool. What I did was is I took, um, I made a hollow dome out of World Edit and built it up. And it was looking pretty cool on the inside. But the, like I said, the outside, I, it just wasn't feeling with the, uh, with the dirt and everything built up. I might try it again. And this is what I came up with. It looks really cool. Kind of like uh, the Biodome. Now, and yes, the Pauly Shore movie Biodome. But the real Biodome in Arizona. And that's something that I'm still, I, I would like to try. I think that would be really cool. So over here, I'm not yet sold on if this is going to be a patio or if this is going to be an extra room. Because it, it was intended to be like a informal living room off of the pool with a fireplace. So if there's going to be a fireplace in the center and then some tables and seating. And I'm still not sure if I want to enclose it. And then this area here, it leads down to the garage that we're going to build right now. And this is going to be a bathroom. And look at those lights. Those lights are really cool. Those are from the Digtron uh, mod. And they, they just, they work out really cool. I wish they were white, but that can be fixed. So there, that's what that is. So we come down this nice little stairway, nice little wood inlay. And this is going to be the scene of the garage. So because I, I was going to put a garage over there, I was going to remove that tree, but there's really nothing over here to continue the road on down. So what we are going to do is we are going to put in, I have these apples all over the place. I can't get the vacuum cleaner to work in Technic. There is a, um, a vacuum cleaner. What is that? Nothing. Oh, molehill. Nothing now. So the idea behind this is it's not going to be a typical garage. It is going to be a glass garage. Well, that might cause a problem too. I don't know yet. So, <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to see how this looks and how it plays out. So this is going to come out to here. This is going to be the actual base which is going to follow the upstairs part. I did a lot of um, landscaping so far on this. That's going to cause a problem. Not really. So how's everybody doing? The, um, it's actually starting to warm up slightly here in Chicago. I am so done with winter. I mean, really. Do I want to carry that all? Yeah, that's what I wanted. Because that's the main wall. So that would be a load-bearing wall. It bears the load. And then what I will do is I will make that better, more better. Put some grass there. And this is what I love about this. Instant grass. Mm. I have to, I have to revisit that. That don't look too sharp. No, it don't. So let's get this done here real quick because what we are going to do, and I'm not sure. Well, let's see what we, let's see what we got. So we are going to mess up. Yes. We are going to put in a driveway real quick. And I, I only want the driveway to go so long. So take here.
Um, there we go. It's yeah. This this should be right. Two. We are going to send that out. For starters, we are going to send that stack that fifteen, and I'll stack a twenty, because why not? Let's see how that looks. And it's going to crash into that tree. I don't need that much. So each car is three wide. So one, two, one, two, three, one, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, I don't need that much. So this is going to be turned back into grass. I got to figure out, there was a way to clear all this, which I'm going to work on because I have a lot of, uh, no, no. I might have to replace the grass. Because it's already growing in... Look at all those apples. <laughs> oh, boy. So, let's get rid of this real quick. Is it going sun... The sun going down again? I've already been doing this for 15 minutes. Actually, 10. So... Let's get this rolling here. I don't want to use the uh, white garage doors on this. I want to use, I got to get rid of these apples. I got to get, um, I want to use, that made no sense. That made no sense. Let's come out here. Man, I am just losing it. Let's see if this set nodes the air. Huh, it's going to make me pick up every one of those, those apples. All righty then, that failed. There used to be, I used to have, um, can't remember what it was, that... I know I have a remove, it will remove unknown objects, but pick up. I should turn, um, I should turn drops on. You know what? I'm not going to sit here and you, that's not what everybody came here for, to watch me pick up apples. <laughs> so <laughs> we need to turn this back and that's going to be awful close. So I want two. I want to go. I want to leave two. That's a lot better because theoretically the driveway does not have to be that wide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's an awful long driveway. Even if I go one, two, three, space, one, two, three, six, seven, I could actually go. Let's try this. See how this looks. Because as you know, everything can be changed. Now for the garage, I am I want to use uh full glass around. I think that's going to look really cool. That's what I want. One, two, let's take that out by, I don't know, let's try 30 and see where that leads me. Whee! Ooh, not bad. How's that for estimationing? I created a new word. So... <laughs> So what's going to happen over here 
because I do not want, I want to uh, sort of create the driveway is going to come over here, the, the entrance to the driveway. Huh. Hmm. What did I just turn on? It looks like, um, come on. It looks like I toggled inspect. There we go. How do I want to do this? I want to come down. That's an idea. There we go. So what I'm going to do is actually come down over here to meet up with the road. And that will work. So that... How many spaces do I have here? One, two, three, four, five, six. Actually, I, I, that's cool. That is cool. Let's see what I can come up here real, real quick because I don't want to make, uh, obviously I have a problem building in that. My videos take forever, it seems. And this is going to, he, this person has a cool driveway. So over here, let's get rid of this. And I'm gonna make a transition. To go up. This is gonna look this is gonna look weird. Hmm. So I'm going to take it back to there. And that's where I'll make my, that's where I'll make my transition going up. Cause why not? I think that, I think that's going to look fine. So let's go here, do this. So a car will come in. That doesn't look good. The car will come in. Make that look real pretty like. And I'm going to change some of that too. Because we don't need. We don't need all this. However, I do like it. How do I want to curve it? Oh. I should try. I should try curving it. Doesn't matter. Be, that's one thing I got to work on. I have to work on my curves. I noticed that um, there's a lot of tutorials that I saw about um, creating curves for roads and stuff like that. I absolutely hate. There we go. That'll work. And that's one area that I really need to work on is is curves. But you see. The one thing that's real cool and what you can get away with is that it's a block game. So everything kind of looks okay um, putting in, you know, leaving everything blocky, which I don't mind that at all. So what we're going to do is we're going to finish this. Huh. Oh, I know what that was. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, no, no. What did I do? No, I didn't want to do that. Stop. There we go. That's how we fix it. And that's called a Florida sinkhole. I could have done this easier, but there's something oddly satisfying about knocking blocks, I guess. All right. So basically I have to lay out, I have to lay out the, um, the house 
and I'm not going to go overboard with bedrooms and stuff like that. However, I do want, I'm tired of doing bedrooms and bathrooms and stuff like that, but everything has to look realistic. And I'm gonna, I want to do some kind of edging from there. I'm going to work on that. So somebody will come in the driveway, which is one, two, three, four, five. So a car can come in. I wonder how that would look. Mm. That looks better. I want that. We come in here and we're going to go up. I thought I had a, there it is. I can actually do this where these are half and then I can put another one here to give it that much more transition. Let's see how that would look real quick before we end this, end this video. Table saw. So we have that one, it would be this one. And Right off the bat, I didn't like that. Okay, so that takes care of that. So we have, put a little street light in, or uh, the parking light in, we come here, we come up, we have this whole area here, which is real cool looking. Then we have the driveway coming in there and need a walkway. I think even though the stairs are three, I don't think I need three. Mr. Chicken. It's really weird over at this area of the house. There's just this enormous lag. And I don't know why. Obviously, it's something in the area, either, in, you know, um, where the trees or something is updating. But it's only over in this area. Let's see how two looks. I might have to go three just to stay with the continuity. Oh, he left me an eggy. How nice. Let's see if I get a chicken out of it. Nope, no chicken. Oh, there's another one. Another one. Oh, look, piece of candy. Nope, no chickens. I think three will look better. And I might actually. <laughs> I told you it's lagging. Yeah, three, three looks better. Any day now. Okay, so that, put a little light there. That looks a lot better. And I'm going over on the video. You know, I, I really don't care. Now let's see, how do I want to do this? Because usually, okay, that comes out, but that comes out one. So if I do that, I don't know if I want to. I don't know if I want to take the wall. Let's try to see how this looks. Okay, that will be. That will be fine. That means I have to change. Oh, where are you going? And that's another thing. I can't figure out why things are sliding the way that they are. Now you see that doesn't look good. I need that there. So let's put that back. Hmm. 
Hmm. First world problems. All right. So there we have three. We are going to go three to make that equal. And we are going to try something here. That's going to look. Okay. Let's see how well this looks before I end the video. And this is all subject to change. Um, I really do like the, the white glass. However, the white glass means that, that looks, you know, you don't get, and I'm going to fix that outside area to blend it, to blend it better. Or, you know, you could just leave it. It doesn't matter. It's nature. <laughs> yep. Okay. That looks pretty cool. I'm I'm liking that. So as always, you can you can voice your opinion in the comments on what you what you like. The whole deal is is that um, you don't have to exactly like the way I do it, but obviously. But what would what ideas would you have in your build? And as usual, um, my website you can upload pictures of your build, which people have done, which is greatly appreciated. Now this is going to be this is going to be kind of a sticky area over here. Let's see how this looks because I'm going to have to finagle in a door, and. Okay, so that comes, that wraps around like that, but the door is going to be on the inside. You know what? That looks cool. It kind of, it. I'm going to have to play with that because it does, it does look, it does look cool. And then for the door, the door is actually going to be here. And one of the ideas that I also have is the um, using the gate controller as usual to now that I know how to use it to <laughs> make this area. What is Mr. Chicken? Trying to figure out why I couldn't walk around. Come on. Somebody should make a mod that auto. Okay, there's our garage door. Three, six. I don't really want to put anything on. I like that. So for right now, let's just do this. We're just going to, until I can make this an open garage door, because I need to get stuff in. That did not work. And I'm thinking about, um, okay, so there's the garage door partially open. So we come down here. This is how the cars will go into the garage. And to make that look real cool, like, before we end this video, do I need that? Yes, I will. Let's go. Vehicle. What are we going to put in this garage? Let's put a Nissan and my favorite Porsche. Because, you know, why not? I don't want to use... Um, well, that just didn't work. That just kind of. What is the deal with that? Usually you stand behind it and you can you can like place it. I want to see how these look real quick before. That's crooked. Come on. I've had I have this weird look at that. Now we're we're on top of the car. Oh, I have to figure out why that mod is doing what it's doing. 
Yeah, this garage is huge. So let's put this one right here. Straighten it out. Cool. There you go. So we have... That's big. I could almost put... I don't know how that would look with... Um, if I divided that off. You know, that's fine. So... I'm going to move those cars over a little bit, put some toolboxes in. I could put a washroom off there, too. And a sink area, because if you're going to work in a garage, this cool. And then, let's put one here. Put one here. Mr. Chicken, you are getting in my way. Put one there and put one over here to give some light because very nice. Look at that. So we have a garage and a chicken. Of course, if you go too fast, you will drive through the garage, which will do that. And I have to put some, I have to figure out where I want to put some doors. I want, uh, the doors will go in the bottom. I don't want to to make this area. And then you have this whole upper area here. And I'm still not sure if I'm gonna keep this as an outdoor room or make it a, an informal living room off of the pool area here to go there. I got some of the Bob Blocks lights up here, which I think are cool. I wanna make some kind of artistic. And then, because I can put patios off the back here. And then back here is gonna be kitchen, dining room, and then a uh, media type room, and then bedroom number one, bedroom number two, and an office. But they're all going to have, there's going to be a hallway down in the front, so you can see out. And there will be a hallway down the middle to get to Mr. Horse, to get, go eat the apples. Dude, go down there and eat the apples. Go on. Really? That's what they should do on the animal mods. Make it so if if there's a um, if there's an apple laying on the ground that the horse can eat it. So there you have it. This is looking really really cool. We have an outlay. We have the driveway put in. We have a block that's out of place out here. Oh no! It just that was the way it looked. I am digging that. I'm not going to lie. That is really cool. And I'm going to do something here because this is going to be made. Um, there's, it's going to have an edging on it. So it's going to have trees and plants and, and uh, shrubbery to please the knights in it. So there. And there we have it. So we have a dead end street. I'm going to have to fig finagle this a little bit better to make this look. I might have to go one more row over here just to, you know, create the transition in. But there you have it. That looks really cool. So let me know in the uh, show or in the, in the comments um, what you would do differently. You, would you keep this as an outdoor, given the fact that I can use it over there and just use this as a, a nice sit, sitting area, an all-glassed-in sitting area, and go from there. And again, these lights are from the Digi, the Digitron collection <laughs> yeah. all right thank you for watching that is how i build stuff right mrs chicken and uh go from there so uh until the next video keep building and uh goodbye